couple days ago I posted a perforation box for Christmas. Someone asked me if I had a video on how I put it together. Well, I didn't, but I figured let's do a Halloween one. So let's put together this Halloween perforation box. This is the design space file, and let's get started. First of all, this is the box part. Take your bone folder and really, really get all those score lines here and here and here and here and just go along and get all your score lines together really really good next we're going to glue it together this is really easy to put together so just take your glue get it all the way to the edges of these little ends the way i like to do it is just look here and there i have it and then sometimes I just like to push down. That one's good. Next. Let's do this one. All good. Let's push it down. Here's the third one. I have a quick drawing. This is Art Glitter Glue, and I get it from MayMayMadeIt.com, or you can also get it on Amazon. It is the best. Get it down. Okay, now this is the easy part. These just press in. See how easy those go down? And then these fold out. And then when you put your confetti in your gift card, there you go. Very, very important. Don't forget. Throw in your gift card and throw in your confetti before you close it up. Ask me how I know. I've done it. So there you go. And I have some cute little ghosts and pumpkin confetti. For my Halloween card. So that's done. Now next let's go and let's get the top together. So this is your the bottom of the top. Okay so you're going to take your moon, get glue all the way around the edges, make sure you have it really well on the perforation so that when you pull it's going to pull both layers. And go ahead and glue this. Okay, now this has to line up exactly. So you can kind of see here. See how I have that lined up? That's perfect. Kind of look on the back. Okay, that's perfect. See how it's ready to rip? And I just like to take a brayer, make sure it's down well. Then for the witch, what you're going to do, take your glue. Oops, that happens. Usually I have it down flat when I do this. Um, just get it all over. And she has perforation on her too. This is gonna be easy to put on because when you put this on, you're going to see the perforation marks. They just go right on top of each other. See here? There's the perforation. There's the perforation. So then when you pull, it's just, it's all going to come right off. Okay. That's all set. Then at this point, if you want to just go ahead Put glue, do not put glue on the perforation. No glue on this, okay? So, and this is just going to center on the top. You have your gift card in there, you have your confetti in there. So you're all set, not on the perforation, the middle. Okay, 
Then what you're going to do is you're just going to center it and see then the perforation is going to open up right there. So go ahead, get it right. You have a little border all the way around, about, about an eighth of an inch. Okay, once again, I like to brayer things down. Now at this point, you could just leave it like this and say, Happy Halloween, hand it over, okay? But what I always like to do is put a little belly band on it. I love belly bands on everything. Okay, so this is relatively easy to put together. For something little, tiny like this, thin lines, what I do a lot of times is I just take a broad tip glue pen, this is from close to my heart, a piece of scrap paper, Throw it on, it goes right on this perfectly. Once again, my friend, my friend the Breer. Okay, and that's down. This will glue right in the middle. right in the middle of the belly band. Okay, then at this point, you can either glue this down or you can, you know, put a pop dot on it or whatever you want. Actually, I'm just gonna grab. These are some close to my heart leftovers from shaker cards. So I'm just gonna set that right in the middle. Put it right in the middle, and there you go. And this goes on super, super simple. Just take it. And I said super, super simple. There we go. And there you go. Enjoy.